And today we're going to be talking about the wall robot, modeled after a famous robot that you all probably recognize. But this is a three in one builder's kit, and you can build up to three different robots. You have the famous, you can also do a dinosaur, and you can do another tank style robot as well. This has top 10 STEM projects for 2022 on it. But what also makes this cool is it's remote control. So after you build it, you can actually drive it with a remote control or you can app control it with many different modes. And we'll get into all that after we build it. So Tanner is our builder. He's going to put this together for us. Wish us luck. Let's build it and then review it. And here is Wall Robot, as they call him. You can see his head swivels. His hands will open and close, and you can kind of move his wrist a little bit. And he came out quite nicely. He's a very good robot. Tanner put it together for us. He did a good job. The little front door opens and closes. And like I said, it's RC. You can drive it around. Now, it was challenging. It wasn't the easiest build, but isn't that the point to make you think? What do you think, Tanner? I liked it. I liked how like um the like the little belly like opens up. So what was the hardest part about the whole build? Probably the head. Putting the head together gave mm -hmm. you the most trouble. Yeah, cause the first time I did it, the eye was like right back here. It was like no. not centered, so I had to redo it. So just pay extra close attention to the instructions when you're building. So, but are you satisfied with how it came out? Yep. Did, you've built a lot of other brands of building systems. Did everything stick together well? or? Mm -hmm. I liked it. So it's, it's made out of a good plastic. It's competitive with any other builder sets like this that you're going to see. Everything sticks together nice and tight, and it works just fine. Yep. Here's the kicker to this. It's also remote control. It comes with this little remote, and it's also app controlled. So what we're going to do is I'm going to set him on top of this rug here that I put on the tabletop, and I'll show you how he drives. It's like tank steering, both up to go forward, both down to go back, and then you can spin either way. He does have a rechargeable battery inside, and he comes with a charge cord, but you do have to put two double A's in the remote, and that's how you drive him. Check him out. Pretty, pretty cool, right? That's cool. And, like I said, you can turn the remote off. It comes with an app that you can download, and the app has different modes as well. It connects Bluetooth. You would pick the black box because that's the type of control box that he has inside. And then you have normal control mode, and you can just use it like a remote control. And you just go forward, back, and you can spin left and right. So very easy. Or you can use what they call program mode. And you can sit there and use take all these directions and speeds and you can build your own program the robot how you want it to go which is really cool but i kind of like the path mode what path mode is if i draw a circle on here he's going to draw a circle whatever pattern i draw on this map is the direction that he's going to go so I like, like that. if i was to draw a tiny little circle and i'm going to try not to let him uh, drive off the table but we'll just on here we'll just do a little tiny circle and then we'll hit play. And he's just gonna keep, he finally finished. Now, if you wonder why he was doing so many smaller spins, when he reaches the corner, for fun, he does like an extra spin. So if he did a square, he would go to that corner, do a spin, go to the next corner, do a spin. So very cool that you can just draw out a path and he's gonna follow the path automatically. And then you have this mode right here. And basically you use your phone's gyro data to control the robot. Like if you lean it to one side or the other, it makes him steer. And then you hit the up or down button if you want him to go forward or backward. So if you just want him to spin, you just tilt your phone. So very, very cool. I like that one. I think I like that one, like the driving one, way more. Than oh, yeah, where you just use this yeah, like a steering cool. wheel. But very, very cool. It is a three-in-one kit. There's another robot that you can build with it, and there's also a dinosaur that you can build with it as well. No complaints. It's just a fun little build. We hope this video helps, and thanks for watching.